In this video, I will show you how to use the exponent key on your graphing calculator. This should work for the TI-84 graphing calculator, the TI-83, the TI-82. Um, it actually will work with most graphing calculators. Now the exponent key is located on the right side of your calculator, right above the division symbol. It's called the caret key, and it looks like an upside down V. To simplify the expression 5 raised to the power of 2, all we have to do is enter the base, which is 5. Okay, then we're going to select the caret key right here above your division key. Okay, and notice how the graphing calculator puts this little blinking box right here to the upper right hand corner. It's prompting us to enter the exponent. So let's go ahead and enter the exponent 2. Now the blinking cursor is still in the exponent and it's okay to leave it there if we want because all we want to do is find out what 5 squared is. But if we had more to this expression, I would come over here to the dial key on the right side of your calculator and use the right arrow key to move that blinking cursor out of the exponent so that, so that it's on the right side of the expression 5 squared. Now to find out what 5 squared is, we just select enter, which is in the bottom right hand corner of your graphing calculator. And you'll notice that the answer um, to 5 squared is expressed on the, well, you know, right below um, the expression. So the answer is 25 and you'll find it on the right side of the main window. So let's just try one more example. We're going to try to simplify the expression negative 3, which is inside parentheses, raised to the fourth power. So I have these parentheses keys on my calculator and I'm going to use them to simplify this expression. So I'm going to select the open parenthesis, type in a negative 3. Now you want to be a little careful. The negative sign is on the bottom row of your calculator to the left of the enter key and it's different than a minus sign. Your calculator may give you an error message if you use the wrong symbol. So make sure you use the negative sign. Then type in the 3 and close your parentheses. You'll notice that our exponent of 4 is on the outside of the parentheses into the upper right hand corner. So now we're going to select this caret button, so your exponent button, and type in the exponent of 4 and select enter and you'll notice we're given an answer of a positive 81. I hope this video helped. Have a great day. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe. If there are other features of the TI-84 calculator that you'd like to learn more about, let me know in the comment section below. Thanks for watching.